Jalen Milrow on fourth and goal from the 31. Firing. Near corner. It's caught! Touchdown, Alabama! My journey is not like other people. I have to earn everything that I've had um, being a quarterback here at the University of Alabama. And it just goes back to just not giving up on your dream, not giving up on what your purpose is. And just like that, Jalen Milrow is the name being echoed around the Alabama campus. But the quarterback's path didn't come without its struggles. Milrow drifting back and now just steps right into the pass rush. And they'll get him back at the 32. Levers right into the hands of a Longhorn. There were some lessons to be learned coming out of the Texas game. You know, how to take care of the ball, how important that was, how we needed him to distribute the ball uh, in a more consistent fashion based on what we're trying to do on offense, help him improve his ability to process and, you know, fundamentally distribute the ball the way it needs to be distributed so we could have success on offense. When he said that the biggest thing was to remain faithful, it's a lot that goes with wearing an A. It truly is a privilege to have pressure, you know? And I see pressure as face everything and rise. I think being benched drove his ego and his drive, even more than he is. He's a driven athlete, always has been. I think it's where you realize things can be taken away. I don't know too many guys who would not only get benched, but being benched against um, USF and just going out there, especially after the Texas loss, and he's still with us, and he's out there cheering us on, cheering the other quarterbacks who was taking his job at the time. Through grit and grind, Jalen returned to the starting lineup and resurrected his career with a newfound determination. You know, Jalen went from a mindset of a guy trying to make plays to the mindset of a guy that was trying to get the ball to his teammates so they could make plays. Uh, and in doing that, makes him a very dangerous player. No one believed in me throughout this journey. You know, I can count on my finger how many people believed in me. But with all that, it took work. It took a, a true grind. It took harping on the little things as far as trying to be the best person I can be. And then it happened a single play that cemented his name among Alabama quarterback legends. The Gravedigger play, it was a play that we repped. It came from repetition, it came from perfecting our craft. It was something that we repeatedly try to harp on and repeatedly try to master. Bill Rowe, still looking, firing, near corner, it's caught! Touchdown, Alabama! With all that, I can honestly say that it took a whole village, and it wasn't just, just me that get me through this journey. But along this journey, it's been a lot of learning moments. It's been a lot of things that I took into consideration to grow as a player on and off the field. I'll just say, you know, little me would be really proud of who I am today.